here. I am Greg. This is Nickel City X Wing. We have got a match between not Velvet and Zimatique, but Dano and Clofax. Betting is open, and I am once again joined by a man so mysterious. Sherlock Holmes sent him a postcard. A man so cavalier. LeBron James wanted to play for him and then leave and then play for him and then leave again. A man so magical, he had to move to Orlando just to make the basketball team's name true. It is Andrew, AKA Yellow Jacket Pim. What's up? Yep, yep, you are gonna do that. Knew that was happening. Ooh. I was doing that or going hard, and I couldn't think of anything did, to go hard with. Did comedy for so many years, I, uh, knew, I knew it. I knew it! Here's from the crowd. Uh, what can I say? I, I'm Cavalier, but I just can't compete with Space Jam 2. Who can? Who can? Who can? That's Who a good question. I mean, literally everybody. Betting is open. Which side do you want here, Pim? Which one do you want? Which list? Well, uh, Insert Top Gear. I like this one, but I like this one meme. Um, because I this, like this one like doesn't Clo help me. I like Clofax's list a lot, huh? but I really like Dano's list. Well, then you do Dano's list. Go ahead. Uh, I'll start with old Dano's list. Okay. Uh, starting at the for 91 points, we got ourselves a thick ray with two C's, maybe a Q. She's got Shattering Shot. She's got Rose Tico Crew. She's got Thin Gunner. And she's got the title, the Millennium Falcon title, letting you do those red maneuvers while stress and boosts and rotates and all that fun stuff. Uh, we've got ZZ Talo with Marksmanship, Predator, and Pattern Analyzer. Not a build that you see very often. Uh, could be interesting. A-Wings don't often do reds, so we'll find out. Um, and then we've got our boy Born to Ill, Licensed to Chill, Elo Atsy over here. He's got one superpower. He's very good at it. Uh, Predator R4, Ferrisphere, and Jamming Beam. Nobby. I don't know. That's a good point. Did he miss it's a game? Not, not a mistake. No, it's 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 Zando. Th yeah. This is what Dano does. That's true. And yeah, it's for Clofax coming in at I1. It's an autopilot drone. We'll talk about docking rules, house rules in a second. Then at I2, it's L337 with a gonk droid, the IG-88D crew, BT-1, and Lando's Millennium Falcon title. And then in the G-1A ugly-ass assault freighter, it is Forlom with advanced sensors, triple zero, and contraband cybernetics. And of course, IG-88A with the IG-2000 title. Now, so because this is 2.5 rules with bumping and AMG hasn't said what they intend to do with docking, which could potentially make a thing. What, we, what we've decided to house rule, and again, I want to be clear, this is 100% my own rule. This is a house rule until we get further instruction. What we've decided to do is you can dock at range zero to one and the ghost title lets you ignore rolling for damage with the host ship so you can bump seems, with the ghost seems title like, seems like the most fair thing to do until um, until hoping, they tell us docking is like range one only now or something yeah i'm hoping that i'm hoping that docking is going to be on the rules and not something they've forgotten about right um, they might not even but, know it's a mechanic yeah, I was gonna say, given it's on like three ships maybe it's not that thought about um but hopefully it is included in these world updates uh because if you only dock at range zero then it's going to be a real bummer <laughs> yeah take a damage to dock that seems um uh, like it's, a it's not change. like it's used a lot so right i, I mean, mean again it's, it's three ships it's the hound's tooth it's lando's falcon and it's um uh, the, the ghost and, bcx yeah yeah and that's it right yeah i think so that's at least for uh, uh, non-epic ships. A real bumper, says Epionic, that is true. 
can't dock with uh, the Houndstooth. You can. Only in dock. I think you can. You can dock with the Houndstooth. You just can't. Do you can't dock with the pup. The Houndstooth allows you to dock with any Z95. The pup you can only undock though. <clears throat> it's a very, very rarely used trick. But technically, the Houndstooth can dock any Z95 you want. Don't know why you would, but you can. Exactly. Yep. Which is well, also how I describe dating me. Don't know why you would, <laughs> but you can. Oh, you've got a lot going on, Greg. I got Funny. zero going on. Literally nothing. Funny, you're smart. You're a good X-Wing co commentator. You see how he couldn't even bring himself you're to save a player? Sick, he tried to save player, but it, like caught in his throat. Oh, yeah, neither one of us are good players, to be <laughs> honest. Can you dock multiple Z95s? Not at one time, but you can dock, like... Say I brought uh, Bosk and the YV, and I also brought like three of the Black Sun soldiers. You could dock each one of those separately, as long as one wasn't already docked. Like I said, it's kind of a neat trick, especially if you've got Marge Sable closure, Marge Simpson upgrade, because after you undock, you can give, um, you can hand out a strain. So technically you can just do it to pass strains out. Again, it's not a good idea. Did Ando just bet all of his nickels on Clovax? He 100% bet all of his nickels on Clovax, yes. Here is another roll. <laughs> Should be able to squat up the inside the hound suit with three C95s. I don't know why they rolled after setup. We haven't had a turn yet. It's gonna remind them that uh, one road lasts from set up the first turn. Also, they have no overlap. <laughs> Three, two, yeah. Three, great. Yeah, yeah well, can't... shut up. <laughs> <laughs> can't argue with that logic. Three forward from the autopilot drone. So now, one forward uh, from L3, who will get the gonk, action baby. to gonk. And a one hard. Now, now, Mr. Long. Gregory, yes. you did mention, you did call the G1A a uh, Frighter. You, do you it's know that ugly is a Starfighter? Frighter. It's a Starfighter, actually. It's not a Freighter. It is not a Starfighter, because Starfighter would mean that it is good. <laughs> well, officially, it is called the G1A Starfighter. Yeah, well, officially, it's called SARS Cove 2. You know what I mean? Officially, it's called the People's Republic of China. Yeah. Clearly a republic. So now, if you've got, uh, if you've got the autopilot drone, sure. is your play to get burn those charges fast, then dock, so you can just throw it Use out? Use it as a bomb. Want? Yeah. Or yeah, do you kinda, like to keep it probably. out for like the block? I see. I like I like docking, starting with it docked, and then releasing it and using it as a coordinator when you get into like the battle area. Yeah, uh, okay. For three I'm turns, with you on and that. then have yeah. it be a bomb. Because, like, people forget about it. I'm kind of with you might, on that, too, It might it soak also... up some shots, too, you know? Exactly, yeah, it draws fire. I, I like that plan, too. I, I think the the bomb trick is fun. I think it works a little bit better as, like, a, a coordinate for a turn or two, though. Yeah, great. I will say I love um, the Falcon... Uh, the Falcon title's ability that allows you to let the, um... Uh, you can use the ability of the drone, or of the, um, escape craft as an additional yeah. pilot ability. That's a really fun, yeah, that's uh, good. piece of text. Especially, uh, I wish that, like... Is it the Outer Rim Smuggler yes. or whatever that lets you... You're gonna attack a range zero of obstacles, which is gonna be a real important ship going forward now. Yeah, um, does it... Can you can you also move over obstacles to let you move over them? No, just lets you attack. You still have to suffer the consequences, so you should still pair it with like Kira. Yeah. Or um collision detector or something like that. But yeah, what is Kira's for, points are going up? Because she's not used all that much, but she could be extremely valuable now. 100 percent I also think um the Outer Room Pioneer has some pretty good synergy with excuse me, 
with the mining guild ties because the mining guild ties can move through off the uh move through the um rocks but they can't shoot on rocks right so you get that iron pioneer close they can still do that too mining guild like ties totally going to be reprinted soon well, what, were, if that, what, if, what if that what if that's are they really yeah they only came out in black box gross yep I so they were a new thing for 2.0 I'm gonna eat this. What is it? What are we eating? What are we dropping, boys? What are we eating, boys? Like a quesarito? Roading for no reason. And that is a dock. The uh, G1A. Players are stressed. Purdue wins the Music City Bowl in a game most didn't care about. Didn't even know it was happening. That's how little I care. Nobby over here just being salty. Remove a shield generator from Rebels to Resistance. Well, it sat in the sun for a while. Boost! Boost. More, more dice, more fun, as said by AMG. I said probably dice for no reason. I mean, yeah, there's no reason yet. Um, who did he pass? Did, did Forlorn pass the stress? Did he keep the stress? I think he passed it to thing. L3, then cleared it. Okay. Okay. Here's Elo. Hello, hello, hello. CIS Falcon win. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> CIS just gets everything, right? I think that's how that works. I mean, the Falcon's already in CIS colors, is it not? True. Blue. At least the scum one is. Fell asleep. Tennessee was kicking butt. Well, not for long. Who's your favorite IG, Greg? In the X-Wing. Who's your favorite IG? Uh, B. B? Is that the double tap one? Yeah, double tap. I'm a big fan of the uh, calc sharing one. Calculate sharing one's great. That's A. That's the one on the board. Yep. Yeah, that's my favorite one. The boost evade one, though, is pretty fun. Real slippery. You take a focus here, because you're getting a shattering shot on IG-88A. No! Nope. Come on! Come on! Wrong. Going into four. That was almost, six like. dice! Yeah, I know. No, only five, because of it's ranged two, three. Six or eight, one. ZZ still out? I, Sith, I, I think CIS will get the sheet feed. I, I, I do think it's going to get the sheet feed shuttle. It's because... so crazy that the CIS doesn't get the sheet feed, considering it's a sheet feed fucking yeah. at the CIS ship. It's insane to me. The only reason I could see them not getting it is if somehow they decided having a, co a uh, coordinate ship in that faction was too powerful. Um, which I don't think is true, but <laughs> I will say they find the the limited use coordinate from uh, the hyena bomber that gets to coordinate, they price that thing super expensive comparatively. Yeah, I don't I think, think they want points. a ton of coordinates there. All right. No, they don't. So this is Ray. This is obstructed range two into L3. Oh, they want to close bets. I hope your bets are in, sons. 80,000 nickels on the line. That one off, that one off, Rick. It is. Free focus for ZZ. Why not? Why? Boost it. Well, because she shot. She shot and 
miss, so she uses her ability to get the focus because it doesn't super matter. Did I miss a roll? Yeah, there's dice in the roll. She shot the range three obstruct into Forlom, Forlom, uh, Natty did. Okay. True, rogue class before the sheath appeared. Rogue class, that can be a 3 3. What are we thinking? What are we thinking for the rogue class? 3 2? Standard CIS style. I guess I could see a 3 2, yeah. No, she only shot once, Nobby. Greg just missed it, and there was confusion about what happened. I think she shot twice. Did she? Or I think I think what happened is she shot once, and he gave her the focus before the shot was complete. So it was ah. throwing me off. Uh, looking at the shattering shot versus just the unobstructed shot, I think you just take the unobstructed here. He's only got one calculate on Forlom. I mean, two. Forlom should have two. Advanced droid brain, right? Or not? I'm sorry, not. No, no. Uh, L3 should have two. L3 has two, yeah. Now I think Forlom. I think you shoot Forlom here. He's got the one calculate. You're still gonna get four dice. I think you just go into Forlom. But throwing more dice. I mean, you still are throwing four either way. I guess you're throwing five on the shattered. But technically, you don't throw dice with shattered shot. You just add a result. So, epionic. I like throwing dice. Well, maybe you shouldn't take shattered shot then. Trick shot instead. Looks like we're going into four long. We're gonna play a game with literally no throws on and TTS. Simulated throws. And adds the blank. Gets the lock. Yeah, I think you just reroll both, right? Yeah, I think so. And adds the bank. Spends the blank for a lock. Well, maybe not. There he goes. He's getting it now. Yep, he's getting it now. Not if you throw them at your opponent. Interesting. Interesting. Spends the lock on the two. Nah, is that how you play X-Wing in Australia? You guys just throw dice at each other? And of course. Hit, hit, crit, coming into Forlom. Forlom rolls one. And it all goes into Forlom. Forlom well, had to have ship. those four shields. <laughs> it's a bad, bad ship. It doesn't deserve to be in this game. There that is, is IG-88A. The range two shot, just barely. Two hits. Uh, you get the focus to spend it up, yeah. Avoid that damage. Hello, takes to the overdrive Poe X-Ring. You know, I, nah. I actually... I started working on it again today. Nobby, I finally found some free time to, to get into it. Um, All he has is free time. Yeah, right. right. His Wish. wife has bad taste in hats. So, like, <laughs> when does he not have free time? Oh, uh, three the shop back. Can't get through. Ray Natty's that. But I, I, I might refund you. I'm having a hard time with this. So I may just refund your this thing. I might not be able to do it, but I'm going to keep trying. I'm trying to do a lighting mod for now, being not having good luck with this T70 model. It's just like there's no place to get these freaking wires through. I need to find someone who's done it before and how they've done it because it is a mess. They trying to do a light up P70? Yeah, yeah. That's gotta be tough. There's not a lot of room there. There's, it's just so small, and I don't have a drawer that's small enough to really get the like uh, channels I need. And I've searched for one, and they're super expensive to get the size I need. And I'm like, I'm not buying a drill bit just for this. I think so, the aiming will be easier, but... I think you just one hard IGA, right? Oh, 100%. Well... I think you I, almost I was, have I to... I was thinking four long. I was thinking you one hard four long. Do you one hard IG? Yeah, why not? That puts you close to that debris. That close, but not on. Alright, you say so. I don't really care about college basketball, or basketball. I don't care about college football that much, Happy. 
I mean, I'll I'll tune in when Florida State's fine, but since they're never fine, I'd never tune in. You know what? We never started time. They never started time, so this is an untimed game. This game is going till the end. Total destruction. Rules. Oh God, no! <laughs> right. All right. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna start the last, it's the start? last X-Wing game of the year. There will not be another X-Wing game this year. I have it. Everybody has promised. Well, this is, Gold, this is only Gold Squadron two. isn't streaming. Hex won't stream ever again. We could play, uh, we could, we could play the um, 12 turns. Nope. Because it's only been two turns. Negative Ghost Rider. All right, fair enough. If it goes till midnight. If it somehow goes to if midnight, this game I'm goes to shocked. midnight, I will fucking cry. A death ray <laughs> game goes to midnight. Yeah. Monroe is New Year's Eve. I gotta figure out something to do. I got nothing, man. I got nothing to do. I'm yeah, but like, I'm, I'm not married. Like, I have literally nothing to do. Hmm, true. I think I'm going to a state park to see some manatees tomorrow morning. Alright, what a lame. But... Hey, manatees, can you even breathe anymore? Ah, uh, we pollute your waters. Actually, this year's been the deadliest year for manatees on record from the state of Florida. And the deadly wait, say it again? It's been the deadliest year for manatees on record for Florida. Okay, well. I mean it's been the it's been, deadliest year for people in Florida, so it's been, it's been a bad year for manatees, that's for sure. Two calculates for L3, but and the reason the manatees are dying is because there's a lot of encroachment right now, especially onto their um, advanced sensors to calculate. Oh no, advanced sensors is target lock. Um actually, Epionic, the manatee death this year. Uh, it is really attributed to a loss of seagrass. Um, the inhumanity, indeed. It, it's attributed to loss of seagrass in areas where they graze. Um, which is why there's like there's been movements to basically just dump a shit ton of lettuce in the river. Um, I'm sorry, actual lettuce? Pretty much. Uh, not actual lettuce, but like leafy greens, yeah. They've just been dumping like a bunch of leafy greens wherever they graze, just to try to like keep them from dying. It's been it's been a bad year for manatees. So, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, we did get that one heart out of uh, IG. Surprised got the four K out of four lawn. I'm I'm kind of surprised. Sweet about that tomatoes one. is basically staying in business via manatee. Oh yeah, one hundred percent. Ray banking left. Ray losing that front arc. Kind of. There's not much you could do there, I guess, and not lose the stress. So. <laughs> I guess you do the sloop next turn and come back in. Ray's not in really any danger where she's at. Nah. I mean, she's taking one shot. Ella yeah, still the is gonna move. Ella worries me where he's at right now. Well, he's probably taking a banger. Yeah. I don't see him doing a turn towards IG because I think that goes over the debris. Um, he's gonna flip the portals closed. Which opens up the possibility of barrel rolls here. Barrel roll and focus. Both? Four straights. Uh, yeah, I would just barrel roll. Maybe take the focus too. Yeah, I'd barrel roll focus actually. Yeah, get some more distance. Just kind of get some focus. distance. You can two bank towards IG next turn, or towards yeah. uh, four lom rather. Yeah, you can get this. I think that probably gets you out of four lom, and we'll make this shot obstructed from IG. And no, we don't worry. I can. R4. I can guarantee you that Ando is not uh, throwing this game. <laughs> just a reminder that Ando bet everything on. I mean, he's winning right now, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 he's got damage on the board. All right, the fives. It's just Andos that experience a little bit, but that's all right. Uh, IG yeah, 88A, the IG 88D crew letting yep. pass L3 pass the calculate. 
couch passing. So good. That's why I love this IG-88A. He's so much fun. Ray has L3 obstructed range 3. Or IG unobstructed range 3. Again, you can get shattering shot. It'd be a bad time to use it. If you want. Well, so, actually, maybe it would. It's three dice to L3. Yeah. And then yeah, you can, can use Shattering here. Add the... Shattering? And then use two. Use the blank to get a lock. Reroll both. Where did she take? Did she take a focus? Oh, yeah. You get to take a focus? Absolutely. Just yeah, just grab focus. the lock for free. And then it's hit, hit, crit. And L3. Yeah. Get the free lock. What's the uh, blank? What's the eyeball? Or what's this head for? That should be out. Yeah. There yeah, you go. I think he thought Ray's ability worked there. Yeah. If not. So he's just taking taking the free lock on it. Yep. Take it where you can. I mean, that's such good action. Oh, there's a reason she costs nine points. <laughs> oh, the blank skis from Clofax. And we've got to see where he puts. So he takes taking two half on the points on the autopilot. autopilot. And one right. on L3. Oh no, half points on his 12 point ship. <laughs> and it's a 6 to nothing lead for Dano. He killed the Nash up pup. Um, surprised ZZ doesn't have Bullseye. Very close. GG's in chat. Uh, 6 point lead shoot. seems. Shoot seems unsurmountable. Here? Yeah, I got a four alarm, I think. Here, two whole dice. Yeah. Two on the one. Yeah, good chance to hit. Dana wins the game. It's true. He is ahead. One hit. Goes in. And yeah, there you go. Shields down. Shields down. Shields down on I on old four log. I just man, I the pilot abilities are so much fun on these G1As, and it's just a bad ship to fly. That's a bad ship in general, yeah. The dial is just terrible. Uh, yeah. Range 3 into Ray, unobstructed. 3v2. Yeah, maybe two hits. Respectable, respectable. Uh, hey. Spend that force? Yeah. And the other force. Is your stick I think. Turn. Yeah, you sloop next turn, you probably won't have a great shot. You bring come back in with full force turn after. <clears throat> four lobs going in right into Ray. Walk and two calculates. Nice. Doesn't need but one. Ends the calculate. Ray needs a natty evade or is taking three. And is taking three. Yeah, Twitch, yeah, I would agree with you. I think that G1A is probably pretty low on the reprint list. And L3. Obstructed into Ray. Of course, it all depends on what or we see. could both get the extra dice into Elo, but nope, it's gonna go into Ray. Yeah, don't split your fire, I don't think. Has a calc, two hits. Ray, one evade. So, into Ray's hall. Think about these scum ships, like, if any one of them shows up in the Book of Boba Fett, I think it's fast track to be reprinted. Like, if we yeah. get, like, an IG Aggressor, or... Uh, I'm not getting the sense that we're gonna see a lot of ships in this series. I don't think so. I don't think so either, but if, you know... Even if you see it just parked outside, I think it still gets a fast track to... I... I'm still kind of hoping we see Dengar. But, uh, yeah, I can hope for Den Dengar. Well, just in, in canon, they were, like, BFF after Boba came back, so... Oh. I'd I'm be hoping to keep cool that like, aspect. I'd be cool if we got any of the uh, the Empire Strikes Back crew right. in the show. We see Forlorn passing the stress to uh, L3. L3 will probably gonk. Debris consequences? Uh, it's... Oh, God, I don't know. What are the debris consequences? <laughs> Roll one hit, hit a crit, take, take hit, take stress. Okay. Yeah, I think the ship probably the most. I don't know. I said the last game. I still maintain it. I think the ship most in need of the reprint right now. 
is the Lambda, just in terms of icon, uh, I iconic ships. Right. Because if you don't have the Lambda in, in this game, it's like... It's just, it's so iconic, you've got to have it in the game, as far as I'm concerned. This, you know, this game about Star Wars spaceships, put the Lambda back in. The Lambda, the TIE Bomber. TIE Bomber for sure, yeah. All the FO ships are black box, correct? No. The Upsilon isn't. So the Upsilon, I, I, I guess... I would love to see the Resistance Bomber come in with some kind of, like, config that would make it better. The Upsilon um, is perhaps the only First Order ship anyone could recognize from the movies. Well, that isn't just a generic tie? Yeah. 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 I don't know, I mean, Kylo Ren's ship got some pretty good time in both Rise of Skywalker and The Last Jedi. What do you think, uh, the Azatuck? It's going to be on the reprint It's priority. in Rebels. It's in Rebels, so... Who knows? It all, again, this all depends. Like, like, everything, it all depends on what comes out in these shows. Look at how ugly this ship is. It's like a plane without wings. It sucks. <laughs> There's a really good mod people do with... Uh, they take the... Um, they take the wings from a K-Wing and they attach it to uh, the G1A and it looks like an A-10 Warthog. I mean, I bet that looks way better. Oh yeah, it looks great. Still, still doesn't look good, but it looks way better than it is. <laughs> we get the undock from the rear. Do we get the coordinate from the autopilot drone? We do get a coordinate. And coordinate L3, but she's stressed, so you're coordinating for long. I guess you barrel roll? Oh no, no missed on your title, so you can't roll. No, but you coordinate a lock or a... He's got the lock. You, you stop on here with. I guess, yeah, you can coordinate a lock onto ZZ then. Yeah, coordinate the lock to ZZ, stop with Forlon to get the calculate. Well, advanced sensors to calculate, stop to get a second one. Yeah. Yeah, moving the lock to ZZ. Okay, I'm with you now. Bring the system page if you're not allowed. Donk! Like donk it! Donk it! Come on! Donk! Donk and jam! Why are you fronting? <laughs> the only bad thing is if you stop at Fort I'm pretty sure you're taking the crit from the autopilot blowing up. Yeah, you definitely gonk here though. You're not having you're not gonna have a great shot anyways. He's gonna take two carefully, he's probably gonna pass one. Yeah, I think that's just for passing purposes. We oh, want the gun to calculate. Yeah, advanced sensors of calc for sure. This is where that mist hunter title comes in such handy, because you could have barrel rolled to the outside, get out of the range. And, and blocked the, uh, off five I... straight from ZZ. Yep, and then she takes ZZ, the auto yeah. damage. Yeah. That mist hunter title for one point is very good, just to get the barrel roll action. And it's a white barrel roll, even. It's not even a red one, which is rare. Ooh, mediums. the one hard fits and doesn't hit. So the trap is laid for ZZ. There is the sloop from Ray, who can boost. She, she thinks she can get a shot here. But uh, looks like... Whoa. And Ello. Right there. This right is there a, with you, DJ. <laughs> this is a Fours white close. talon, but stress. Open oh, spoils. Okay. Get the block. ZZ. She can still take the focus if she wants. Yeah, ZZ can't focus. And this is just a little bonus damage here for the autopilot drone. You're going to do two shields onto Ando. You're going to take one crit yourself. It's not the best trade, but it's not terrible. No, sure isn't. And looks like ZZ will indeed take that focus. Yeah, for sure you take that focus. It's it's an A-wing. You can deal with the stress. End of the activation, that bomb goes off yeah that's another uh six points for ando actually it's more because it's about to get half points on uh elo uh pa stun pilot all right that's probably the best thing you could have gotten i would argue and zz takes the shield 
Her shields on ZZ and LO, but it's hard to hit ZZ, so take it while you got it, eh? Yep. Pass him to calculate two IG. That makes sense. He's taking two yeah. shots. I like this. Ando is in the or Dano, excuse me, is in the lead with 40 points. Right, no shots. So it goes to Ello. Range one. Classic 4v3. No mods here for Ello. Which almost guarantees Natties. No mods, he's got to stress. Natties for sure, right? Natties for sure. Natties for sure. Definite Natties. If I'm wrong, 25% off on pendant entries with code nickels. Okay, you already had that, but yeah. yeah. He's, he's playing you all. He's playing you. If they didn't show up for... Ooh. I was wrong. Hit crit, crit, crit. What is he tapping on? Jamming it was a jamming, jamming beam? beam? Why are you using Why? jamming beam here? What the hell is that about? Spend a calc, have one hit, doesn't matter. Well, he spends the calc to, yeah, you either take a hit, lose a calc, or he spends the calc and take nothing, so. Why? Oh, that was a bad call. I feel like the rogue class means you want to the cure axe. It all depends on what the rogue class is, I think. If it's like a 3 3, maybe. I don't know. And again, like, this all changes, right? If one of these shows up in a, one of the shows or something. 2v3 now from ZZ into IG. Well, if they show up in the rogue squad, it will be that's coming eventually. <laughs> but will they ever show up? Will that oh, movie I'm ever thinking. happen? IG uh, spends I think that one. Movie will happen. I think I that think movie's it, happening. I really want it to, so... I think that movie's happening, but... It's easy, huh? I don't know if I agree with shooting ZZ here. I think I would take the range one shot. But... Last remaining calculate to get three hits. I totally agree with shooting ZZ. They are fire. They ZZ will have to spend both tokens to take nothing. And you get a nice True. little banger here with Orlov. It's gonna be range two with two calculates and a lock. He takes half points. ZZ spends oh, he's keeping the evade. Keeps the evade. Pass it Again, in. spend it while you got it, folks. Spend it while you got it. Yeah, I definitely agree with that call. You spend it while you got it. Because if you don't have it, you spend it, you're gonna feel real bad. Or if you if you don't get the chance to spend it, I should say. Range two shot. In the ZZ, getting ZZ off the board here would be so clutch. You have a target lock and a calc. Spend it on both here. We I think we talked both. about this last time. You reroll both. Yeah. But the math is you reroll both. Easy. One damage. That's one, and L3 is going to have not a great shot. So, same result shot. either way. L3 is... still gets the bonus because it yep. is getting to be stressed. Range 3 obstructed. Three dice. Three on five. Eh. Don't tell me there's no shot. And that's crit, a crit, crit. with BT1. BT BT crit, makes crit, it crit, crit. ZZ one two Ooh. no ZZ falls down goes ZZ down goes ZZ the end game piece well yeah that's it's not great that's not great if you're Ando Dano it's a nine point lead to Colfax forty nine to forty more like ZZ X blow Nobby. Navi was just like drinking coffee and like swallowed down the wrong pipe and he's like something terrible has happened. <clears throat> I feel a great disturbance in the forest. Planning face syndicate showing up. Who's that planning face syndicate? Hey, which which one of them do you think runs it? I don't know who else is in it other than Psych. There's there's Tanner and Psych, and then there's one more. Who do you think runs it? Do you think it's I the think third it's mystery man? Do you think it's Psych? Mystery man? I don't think it's Psych. What is, what is this? Yeah, we don't know. This is an untimed game, baby. This is the last game of the year. Are you trying to rush it? Yeah, we we you trying uh, to rush it. 
They forgot to turn the timer on. We forgot to turn the timer on. There's no timer. Fucking show you guys. This is going to death, man. This is death match. No hard, no holds barred cage match. We're not opening the cage up until one of them is out cold. There you go. Minutes. Timer's accurate. Every <laughs> time you ask what time is it, we're just going to increase the time more. Forlom has to do a blue here. That's uncommon for Forlom. Usually he gets to do reds all he wants. That's your 98 minutes. G5 yeah, I just took out what? Four hours? No? At least. Wait, how many how many minutes until the new year? There's gotta be a countdown. How many oh, minutes uh, easily, yeah. until the new year? Can't do that math quickly in my head. Sixteen sixty-five minutes. Yeah, so that takes us halfway there. Over halfway there. Uh, true, twelve hours forty-six minutes if you're Nobby. Nobby's in the future. Okay, Still rolling the you. road. Not like it matters. Um yeah. cold bags can see. Yeah, they're still so rolling think... road for no reason. Hello has to do like a one bank towards IG, right? Respawn all deaths and track points point. for the next 28 hours. Yeah, that'll work. Please no. Oh, contraband. using contraband. And the band censoring to calculate. All right. Oh, <laughs> what a bunch of nonsense. You can band censor that, yeah. He could have advanced sensor that all he wants, but... but I think like, he, oh, he did. He chose not to. He chose not to. I see what he did. Uh, he chose yeah. not to so he can get close to the lock. I'm tempted to Bro, say boost, but I kind of don't want to be without calculates here. No, I, I think wouldn't. probably sure. get the block, but that's still a shot now. Ugh. Yeah. L3 chose to gonk this turn, just so you know, too, Greg. Regen that shield on the counter. All right. Um, but if you could have passed calculates and get a boost, that would be great. Yeah. All right. Right? Two straights. Does not bump. No. Ray is just going to take so that not focus. Much you can, yeah. There's not much you really want to do. Um... The odds of Ray just uh, deleting Forlom. Look at look at little Elo. Oh, Elo going four. through. All right. It's a starboard slash, right? I wish, wish he closed foils. He could barrel roll here. But oh man, that barrel still roll got just looks great. Yeah, I think you just focus here. Yeah, you can focus, then you can uh, do a talent next turn and probably be in a good spot. Rolling board dice is more fun. I mean, that's not not true, I guess. Rolling dice is fun, in general. We haven't even started shooting. Colfax is already setting dials. He's a planner. What do you say? What, what, what can you say? Isn't the stress pass at the end? Oh, he's he's triple zero ring. I see what he's yeah. doing. Triple zero. Man, if, if, if Ando had Corsella on Ray right now, that would be awesome. Because he's about to get two stress if he takes the... Uh, he'll, get, he'll gain at least one from Forlom if Forlom doesn't die. And Ray's Ray taking the stress. It's Tanner at the helm tonight. There you go. That's who's, playing. That's who's on the uh, t old Twitch chat. Danny Tanner. Good old Danny Tans. All right, here's LL on to L3, 3v1. Or it crit. Spends it. Yeah. L3. Not bad, not bad. Taking two. Takes two. Still got, got that gonk shield back, so really you only lost one shield there. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Yeah, and, and the, the blank on defense means that your calculate wouldn't have done much, which is yeah. always kind of nice. Here's Ray. Me wants could I mean this could be a kill. 
It's absolutely it's, beautiful. It's not hard for Ray to get four hits uh, at range one, especially Death Ray. Yeah. That, that's not a hard thing for her to do. Uh, a little harder now. So you add the blank, what? spend the blank for the lock. Yep. Yep, spends a blank for the lock, can reroll all three, and with the force, should still be able to get four on this. Yeah, the math is still pretty good with the force and the focus. Yeah, I agree. And Gray's ability, obviously. Just reroll both. Why would you not? Right, I'm... Yeah, there's no downside to rerolling both here. Yeah. Hit. There you go. You need a That's result on defense. You need something. You need something. Anything. Anything at all for love. Netter reporting to us from the future. Hello, Netter. Good evening, good morning, good night, wherever you may be. That's a dead for That's a shame. Yeah, it seems reasonable. Oh yeah, the ship you hate so much is gone. Such a shame indeed. Yeah, but I wanted to see the banger back. Yeah, we got we got old IG eighty eight. IG eighty eight A three V one into red. Sorry, but not really sorry, says Navi. IG's been pretty consistent this game. Two. You could spend that force. I think it wasn't an arc. Was he an arc? Let me let me check. It looks like it arc to me. I don't think they haven't checked, so it doesn't show up in chat. Maybe it wasn't. Either way, Ray has taken it. Nope, not an arc. Can't do it. Just barely out. Oof. So, Ray took two more. Down five. L3 now, I'm just gonna try and pop something into Elo. For one. Two on two. Elo's got it. <clears throat> there it is. So yeah, oh yeah, you here for I should have definitely rose. Should've yeah, definitely, should've definitely rose, rose was... but you sloop now with IG right to the left. So that gives you a great angle. Ray's not too harding right, I don't think. Probably. I mean, the the only thing I would be worried about would be Ray too harding right, which I don't think she will. She could sloop, and then you just kind of have two not great shots, and then you kind of she sloops, go straight at each other. Can't be to the left. No, it'd have to be towards the debris. So you probably yeah. won't be shot. Well, I think you're pretty safe to sleep for four K your IG. Can you have another ten minutes to the timer? <laughs> it would get low. It doesn't let you do four digits. I know, but we're down way. between uh yeah, we can have at least nine and a half, right? Oh, I'm sorry. If this game goes nine hundred and ninety minutes, I'm calling it. All right, that's his fact. Spectrum will call me first. They'll be like, listen, bro. After everything we went through, you're going to do this to us? Really? <laughs> Happy New Year. Um, too hard for uh, Ella, right? Just too hard towards L3? Absolutely. Because I like that matchup. Like, and if I I'm... think that, T that T70 can definitely take on the uh, Falcon without much trouble. Yeah, but I think if you're L3 here, you boost. You bank and then you boost. Yeah, that would be pretty good. And not take that shot. Which would be pretty yeah. awesome. Okay. Uh, the clock netter is that they forgot to set the clock, we forgot to set the clock, so it's just... We're playing until they die. It's a cage match. Yep, it's a cage match. No one gets out of the cage until someone's down on the ground. Get busy living, get busy dying, you know what I mean? What you mean, baby? Uh... Huh. Yeah, okay, you know, so he took it back. All He's right. listening. He's, He's listening. listening to us. He's listening. Oh, not what listening that much. He did 4K. He did 4K. So well, I did. I said you could three. I said you could sleep or 4K. Oh, I only had the sleep part. I wasn't paying attention. Uh, and and uh, hello, hello is doing a close. Right. Which way is he going? Because I think that goes over. Okay, he's going the safe way. All right, cool. I thought he was going towards the old uh, rocket for something like that. Doesn't seem like the best plan. Although it doesn't appear to want any of that smoke from L3. Yeah. 
fast as these games are going, Greg. Just, what do you mean fast? This is 990, 80 minutes left in this one. Fast. Last X-Wing match of the year. We can't play another one. There's no more X-Wing. Yeah, this, this, this is the last X-Wing match of the year. There's no more. There's, There's no more X-Wing this year after this. And if I catch you playing a game of X-Wing after this, oh boy! Ray went for the boost, could not make the boost. She couldn't get the stress. Nope. Don't love the boost there. I wasn't sure what you were going to get out of that, but maybe distance from IG, I suppose. I mean, it's, it's, kinda, shot. it's just donating an extra die to L3, really. Yeah, that it is, too. So that is unfortunate, but... Right? I'm going to be LFG after this, just so I can get some screenshots and send to Greg. Yeah, go to the LFG. They won't even let you in. I called them. I'm like, we get the last game of the year. Crit. Greg gets a crit and an eyeball. He's just taking the lock with old Rose Tico. Do you spend the force? Probably. I'd spend the force. Why not? Yeah, I'd, I'd spend it. So listening. He's 100 percent listening. <laughs> He's so listening. Two ah, lids. We tricked him. And I'll pick and I'll ping the table if you got your computer today. And he's getting a new computer, everybody. We should oh, yeah, the computer. see some like hot man. That's got a 3060 in it. I mean, nice. IG natties. IG, you salty dog. Ray should get two here. Two dice with the force. Ooh. Could spend it. I would spend it. Takes one. I would yeah. too. You don't want to be taking yeah. damage you don't have to take right now. Absolutely. Well, you're only down to four health. L3, three rock. dice. BT1 available. Gets it. Hit crit. Right? Nice. nice. Ray, you salty. Criminal. Raise an A-wing over there. It's like, I got this. And we are back to Dials. Ando the cheater. And Clofax. <laughs> the... Uh, I don't even have a good aim for Clofax right now. Score's pretty close, but I feel like... We Clofax gotta be careful pretty... right now with Elo and Ray. I feel like Clofax is pretty, pretty clearly in the, the driver's seat right now, right? In the driver's seat, yes. I don't think he has Does, it yet, but I think he's... I've been in the car with him before, though. <laughs> Is it the safest spot? <laughs> no. Well. <clears throat> he's definitely in the driver's seat, but I think Ando is not out of this game yet, for sure. No, I think you open foils, one straight with Elo, and then... Go through sloop. with Ray. Yeah, sloop. Ray. Crispy talking smack on Snapple. What? I have to say I tried Snapple iced tea and it's horrible. All right. Can you ban him for that? Or time him out at least? <sighs> yeah, I don't know. Oh, Seems like a time outable offense. Uh, goes to Clofax. I think he's had it consistently. I said sorry. <laughs> I said with all due, due respect, after I say that, I can say whatever I want. Yeah. Ridiculous. Yeah. Ridiculous. After I say with all due respect, I can say whatever the hell I want. You take that 10 second time out, you think about what you did. I would double calculate. Yeah, it seems good. I'll be drinking lots of iced tea tonight. What kind of iced tea will it not be? Are we talking like adult iced tea? Probably like Tim Tam flavored iced tea. That sounds great. It doesn't sound great, but I like Tim Tams. <laughs> yeah, Tim Tams are good. Iced tea. <laughs> yeah, Tim Tams are good. I don't think Tim Tam iced tea would be good. Hey, there isn't gets any through. tea in it. It's just piss. That's all of this. Straight kangaroo pee. Not be iced tea. You rotate with Ray? Boost? Either way, you're donating a dice 
I like the, the boost, boost because it does get you huge. Yeah. Well, it gets you out of IG's shot. I guess, but then I don't know. I, if you rotate, you get the shattering shot. With you only lock. have one. You only have one force. But you got the lock. Yeah. So you yeah. still. I mean, it's not terrible. It's not ideal, but it's not terrible. Boost here, says Nobby. All right. If you're listening, Yendo, you should boost here. You could sloop next turn, but then you're stuck with three stress. Isn't great. Yeah, but you're probably not living. That's true. That's why Corsell is such a great upgrade. Great yeah, upgrade. Think she gets the ban hammer? Ban hammer? Blah, 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 blah. Since we are getting floating mandos next year, we'll see floating super bad. I hate the idea of more turrets. Um, it all depends on how they're implemented. Yeah, if it's kind of a turret, that sounds kind of sucky, but... I guess if it's a turret that can't mod anything. I mean, I do like the idea of being able to run someone over in this game. Just plow an A-Wing directly into, like, a, a group of people. Um... This is Hello on IG, I think. Floating Super Battle Droids are in the DGS 047 art. So, that doesn't mean they're going to be in the game, but it's a pretty good indication they will be. So, so this is actually on L3. Three hits there for Hello. Pretty good. L3, two. Is that half yet? No. More than that. You need one more for half? Two more for half. No, one, because six. Six damage. So two more. I can't count. Ignore me, everybody. Um, oh, I see. Have, then. I see goes in the You say something? Can't lock you more. You might as well. Three. Three. That count for three. Okay, swim force. Take two. Send focus. I already decided to sit, decided to do neither of the things clap. that we advocated for. I decided to sit there and focus. Ray takes the, uh, spends the force instead of the uh, focus, I guess. She's gonna keep the focus. Oh, Ray takes one more. No three. The shop downtown. In the rig, I would assume. In the rig, link three obstructed. What is El what is Gerg been up to? Yeah, that's a good question. What are, what are Gerg's? What are, what are Gerg's New Year's resolutions? Gerg's New Year's resolution is to stay fly. Stay fly? That yeah, seems good. Yeah. We could all learn from that one. I think so. Chris can never save up from Gerg. It's too many, too many miles redeems. I was saving up for uh for tell me a joke, but he got rid of it. So Well let's be honest, all Greg's jokes are kind of bad. I disagree with that. I still really like that special you recorded. <sighs> Special's old just like Greg. There's a few jokes in there I haven't stopped I haven't stopped thinking about it to be honest with you. There's some really good jokes in that one. Yeah. What's your Just favorite? living my head rent free. The Pop opening with the, Gre the the opening with the Gregorio one is very very classic. Not very good easy. for an online album. Not good for like an audio album. But I don't know. I think the art makes it pretty clear. But. I think it was easy. I, maybe it's just because I know what you look like. Maybe that was easy about it, but yeah. The um, <laughs> uh, I think you 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 you, you said uh, Jason Siegel, but you meant Seth Rogen. Seth Rogen, yeah, I did. Yeah, 100%. that was that was a good uh, anecdote one. No the second tries. Wars, the the Water Wars one I think was fantastic. I love that Water Wars one, um, and it's completely based off true stuff. And and then the end joke that was tied into the earlier one about climbing over the fence really really killed me the old callback it was a very good callback. Well, star wars reference in that one yes it was good jokes in that one man 
Like I said, I, I, I'm still thinking about that one. Ray it got preachy at one point, though. Did they say it got preachy? Yeah, you got kind of preachy. Yeah, I don't care. Talking all about how, oh, history books, I didn't like Donald Trump. Like, all right, whatever, man. Well, yeah, because that's what history books are going to say. I've read history books, and they're going to be like, everyone loves Trump. And I'm like, no! No! <laughs> Please! Do not do that to me. One hundred and seventy-seven minutes left in this one. Phew. How long is the entire Star Wars saga in minutes? Anyone add that up? Yeah. Can someone uh, do that for us, please. Just, just one through nine. Let's not count the spin-offs. One through nine. Wars, anything like that. Yeah. We won't, we won't count the side stuff. <laughs> the game has a ghost of time. We still have enough to cur like permanently gurgify Craig. Um. I didn't L3 know that Falcon had a 4K. I did not know that had a 4K. Truthfully. Okay. What, what, oh, he's seeing if the 3 sloop would have fit. So out of curiosity, I guess. Okay. Yeah, so he has the one straight dialed in, but he was seeing like, yeah, maybe I can 3 sloop. He wasn't sure if he was going to live, I suppose. But... 73 minutes approximately. You know, I think that's probably a little conservative for how long the entire Star Wars saga is, but I could be wrong. I think that might be incorrect. Hey, you know, like I said, just maybe a bit of a conservative estimate, really. We're gonna try to do the uh, old Hello Atsy special. Oh, he's got all day long. 773. Forgot the seven, that makes sense. 773, that seems short. I figure they're all over two hours ish, right? Maybe the first one isn't, but. Well, no, that's all 11 movies. I don't want all 11 movies. I just want nine. That's what I'm saying. Like, so that's 120 minutes times nine? There, hang, on, so, hang on, hang on. Because I've got, I've got it for Solo and Rogue One, but I don't want to include those two. Oh, and here it is for all nine, not including the two. Uh, a grand total of 19 hours and 36 minutes, or 11, uh, 1,176 minutes. Yeah. 1,176. Ray gonna do Ray things, gonna add the die, already has a lock. So, we're just gonna spend the lock on all four, I think. Yeah, I'd go for it. Why not? I don't know why he pulled one away. I don't know why either. Just add it and then re-roll it. it. Might just be missing triggers because I don't know how often he's flown death ray. Yeah, already had the lock. You can you can just there roll that blank. Yeah, there you go. You got it. You got it. Yep, close. Good enough for government work. Hey, I work for a government. Not very hard, but I do work for. <laughs> no one. Oh, I don't clip that one. Um. Friends two taking a crit into IG. You could have rolled that blank. I feel like that was just a missed trigger on Ando's part. Yeah. But that's okay. Yeah. Uh, I don't think, think we're gonna get any other shots. shots, yeah. Yes, yeah, so that was a that was a pretty good turn for Ando. Yeah, good turn there. Of course it's coming to a head next turn. IG is gonna one hard, I would assume, next turn. Do you just run Ray straight into him? I mean, you don't and have just a you lot don't get, of options. And just say you don't get the mod shots? Is that is that what it is? Like, you just... The rammer? rammer? Yeah. yeah. Just kind of ram them and say, like, yeah, let me just take your dice versus mine, I guess. Although, yeah, but his, mod, his, right? his dice are so much better in that scenario. <laughs> True, but you know it's an auto-evade with Ray's ability. Possibly two auto-evades with the forward, with Finn and the forwards, because defense can still mod, right? Right. Like, so yeah, I, I feel like that's not a terrible plan, just to, you know, yeah, give him the old left tap. The old slam maneuver. 
It's not actually a slam, but... It makes me dis- it always makes me sad that slam doesn't actually mean involve ramming ships, because that sounds like a lot more fun than what it is. Sure does. Sure does sound more fun. What it is- what it is is pretty fun, but still, if I could just ram ships, hell yeah, I'm doing that. You kidding me? 973 awesome. minutes left! Just enough time to watch the first eight Star Wars movies. Maybe... Maybe only the first seven and a half. I'm not sure what the time breakdown is towards the end, but... Probably skip hey. the last two. I disagree with that, but alright. Skip the last one. But... I haven't, I haven't watched it since it came out in theaters. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it is okay. I've rewatched but... uh, 8 and 9 a couple times now, and I'm gonna stick with my statement that you can just skip the last two. I love 8. I, I still love 8. Uh, it's garbage. I disagree with that, but alright. Take back those nice things I said about your Oreo joke. Fine. <laughs> Uh, you boost was right here, right? Yes. <laughs> See no. you fucking later. I guess not. <laughs> <laughs> nope. All right. All right. Well, that's not great if you're Ando. All right. So Elo has to roll. Takes a stress. We'll have yep. to roll. Hit or crit takes a damage. Take the damage. Shield. And no shot. No shot for him. Well, he can. He can. He can shoot range zero. Not when he's on an obstacle. You can't shoot on obstacles. Oh, is he over? Did he overlap it or is he on? He's it? on that. He's on that. Oh obstacle. yeah, he's straight on it. No shot. Right. Yeah, he's he's out of luck, Chuck. Ray, going range one. Well, this this could be this could be painful if you're uh, IG. Is hurting me to watch. It, it, you know what, Navi? He's learning. We gotta, we gotta support him. He's learning. Um, Finn, a blank. You, you've only got one force. So you can only convert one, so you get a lock at least. I guess you just re-roll. Yeah, re -roll both. The, yeah, you re-roll both. The, the math says both, especially when you have one force to convert a blank. Yeah. Well, math lied to me. Yeah, um, I mean, it didn't lie to you. It's still one. True. That is true. Ooh, uh, that's three. That's half yeah, points half on IG. Points. Okay. Ando taking a lead. If only the game would end now with no shots back. Chris, that is correct. You cannot shoot on any obstacles now. That is any the new obstacle. Yep. Asteroids, debris, cloud, whatever. That, uh, if it's an obstacle, you cannot shoot on it. Four dice back from IG. And that's and uh, four that going into Ray. I think that's a, a dead, dead Ray. Ray. Ray is dead. Long live Ray. And Clofax retakes the lead. You think uh, um, Daisy Ridley's ever coming back to Star Wars? No, I think she hates it. I'd probably hate it too if I went through what she did. Think any of them come back? Uh, Jonas. Oh yeah, I mean yeah, he loves it. I mean he didn't like. Yeah. But he didn't get any hate because he was just like, oh yeah, I'm, you know, he's just in a suit the whole time. Hello's final shield. I don't think John Boyega comes back. Oh no, he he fucking hates it too. Yeah. He said as much though. Like he's he's very clear on his stance. Yeah. Well, he feels like he was lied to. Yeah, I would agree with that. I so he's just he... looking if he didn't if he didn't bump, he just he'd still go over if he didn't bump. Yeah. Um, uh, I don't know, just come back for any like any sequel series that ever happened or whatever. They did no, like another series or TV show or cameo or whatever. I can't imagine any of them. Adam Driver maybe because he was the only one who I think everyone actually loved in it. But Kathleen Kennedy must no, Axion, don't don't subscribe to the Kathleen Kennedy stuff. That's so stupid. Yeah, I don't You like Anyone Mando? Says, any, 
anyone who says she must go doesn't understand what her role is. Like, you don't understand her job if you think she if she's the blame for, like, the movies you didn't like. Yes. I just, that's not what her job is. <laughs> really? Because she's destroying the war. Oh, she is. How so? I would love to hear how Kathleen Kennedy has destroyed the Star Wars lore from you. Because I guarantee you she didn't make the decision to wipe out the EU. I guarantee you she didn't make the decision to make a sequel trilogy. She's just producing them and in charge of, like, hiring people and choosing stuff, like... She's not trying to make Star Wars in her own image. She's been a successful producer for, like, 30 years of other Star Wars movies and Indiana Jones movies and a lot of movies that you like. Well, I also don't unless everyone's like, Kathleen Kennedy must go. I love Mando. I'm like, um... Yeah, what do you think she did? Like, <laughs> everything that Star Wars has been has, yes, she has said yes on it. Why have all these big directors been hired and left their projects? I wouldn't say it's her fault. I would say it's the Lucasfilm story team. Or even the executives, man. I also think it's Disney. Yeah, I kind of think, think it's it is Eisner. too. I think Disney has a very specific brand. In oh, it's not Eisner for... because Eisner's not there. Whatever. Who the f who's the who's that? Bob right Chapek now? is now, but it was Whatever. Bob Iger. Yeah, it was Whatever Bob Iger. It was, it was definitely Iger. Yeah, something happened here, and there's damage coming in from it. Someone shot. <laughs> Hello uh, shot at uh Hello shot IG got three hits on. I think IG's dead. Oh no, IG's on one. Okay. I'm saying give it to the Felonian Fraugro. Okay, but she has done that? Like by all intents and purposes, it seems like they are currently like writing shows and making stuff. Yeah, Feloni is making a shit ton of shit. Yeah, and so is Favro. Like he wrote yeah, Fuck the Fav Fett. Again, people who people are also busy Kevin in the Kevin MCU, you. like yeah, like, people, all of his... people who she's not trying to influence their direction that's what we're saying <laughs> she just hires them people who are telling you she's well, trying to influence I, I their direction I don't know where, where are you getting that she's influencing their direction like what what is that based off of the only people who are telling you that are selling you something people who that, are that, telling you that are people? selling you something Axion Axion what people when you say that's that, what people are saying yeah. what it's, people it's, it's reddit conspiracy theories and clickbait youtubers like there's no evidence that she's trying to, like, manipulate her image. It's the dumbest conspiracy ever. The bloggers and YouTubers who right? say it's that not are, not like... an influencer. If I could influence people, oh my god, could you imagine? <laughs> could you imagine the, how evil I would be? But guys. The bloggers and YouTubers who, who write those stories do so because people keep clicking on them. Like, the more they get you angry, <laughs> just like regular politics and news, the angrier you are, the more money they get because you keep coming back. Yeah, that's why I uh, <laughs> I just stop with like uh, Star Wars theory. He's the worst one of that. Terrible with it. Was yeah. Fucking awful. He's I, I terrible can't stand that guy. He's so bad. So what does Boyega and Daisy really say about her? Uh, anything public is like very kind and nice and pleasant. Like the things they've publicly stated aren't about well, Kathleen Kennedy. <laughs> yeah, Boyega was felt like he was lied to by. Ryan Johnston, and then Abrams, he, felt, he felt like JJ set him up to be something, and then Ryan kind of took that from him, and then JJ didn't give it back. Well, like, JJ gave him, he just like fucking did nothing with him in Rise of Skywalker. Yeah, JJ, yeah. You know, I think, yeah, I agree with that. At least, at least, I mean, Ryan Johnston gave him a plot line. We did. JJ just forget it. He has a Ryan plot Johnson line. took everything away from him. He's got a great arc in that movie. I know. He, he hated his arc. That, I mean, this is from him. He doesn't like his arc in Last Jedi. Yeah, but I can disagree with him on that. Sure, you can, <laughs> but I mean, if we're talking about how he feels. Yeah, I know. I just think he had a good one. Um, yeah, anyone who says Kathleen Kennedy must go, though, doesn't understand how, like, producing movies works. Well, that and, like, a Star Wars movie doesn't get made on one person's like blaming one person for all of it is kind yeah. of insane just because like i don't know if you guys have ever made stuff but 
She said there was no source material for the sequels. Yeah, I mean, there wasn't because Disney decided to make the EU not canon because they could sell more product if they made it not canon. Yeah, well, that and also, like, all right. Did you want to see Heir to the Empire movies? Did you want three no. sequel trilogies where you no, knew God, what no. was happening? If like, you read really some of those, like some of those old well, ones I, are bad too. I mean, okay, like, like just take, just take like, like the old Heir from the Empire with the clones and stuff. Like that's bad shit. But like, yeah. First off, it was forty years later. Yeah. So, you know, you couldn't have Luke in his prime, like, young-ass Luke, young-ass Han. You knew you couldn't get uh, Harrison Ford for three movies. Like, you can't get a young Leia who plays a pretty big role in the, mm -hmm. like, F thing. And also, like, guys... He's not stressed. It's uh, uh, L3 who's stressed, by the way. Heir to the Empire, like, that whole series... Yes. Can we yeah. be honest with each other? It's batch. It, it's aged it's, so poorly. Like some of these things have just aged really bad. It's insane. L three got stressed. I think L three boosted, right? Yeah. And then it boosted at some point, but why would boost here? I think. Give yourself the is dubs in the sequels. Haunted deadbeat dad. Yeah. Like yeah. I mean, I wouldn't call him a deadbeat dad. I would say he's a guy who gave his son to his brother in law to train and then his brother-in-law failed and then han just kind of like what do you do when your son abandons you it really does answer the question what happens when your son is hitler yeah like, like what the hell are you gonna do i mean if i was yeah if that happened to me i'd kind of disappear as well yeah luke almost gave in to being his father and then his failure Listen. led to everything he loves being destroyed Axion, like, I don't disagree that I hate with what they did with Luke. Like, I don't like that either. I don't like curmudgeon Luke. Hashtag not my Luke. But I didn't want to see Legends continuity come to life because, yo, it is... I don't get to. People, like, people, people get mad at Luke for running away and becoming a hermit. Yoda did the same goddamn thing. Like, Yoda failed at killing the Emperor, and ran away. <laughs> like, he didn't go start a resistance, or like start a rebellion, or like start a new Ch Jedi Academy. He just fucking ran away. <laughs> we never and knew it, Yoda before? What do you mean we never knew Yoda before? Yeah, in, in 1980, that's correct. We never knew him before, but that doesn't make it any less different. For Dude, right, to have straight away. up, I found, I found a message board that's been archived from 1985. And the Star awesome. Wars opinions people have there, Star Wars fans have not changed. I promise you. That's fantastic. I love that. And literally, this is why let I me hate this franchise. Let but... me pull up. Let me pull up a fucking quote. This is this is okay. I had this discussion with my wife recently. This is why I like Marvel more than Star Wars a lot of the time, because like Star Wars fans get so angry at each other and like of what should be right, but like Marvel fans, because there's like seven thousand comics continuities. They're so much quicker to be like, yeah, who cares? Like, whatever. I don't like this version of the character. So, okay. Just so so this, is, this, is from, this is from 19... This is a... This is a someone... I did crit from... Ooh, hello. Not, Sorry. Nice shot. This is a someone saying on a message board on the early-ass internet, the original Star Wars. That's, that's Dead a, IG. That's a Dead IG. Ooh. From its opening soon, the moot... Oh, sorry. From its opening scene, the movie loses any semblance of realism. So the spaceships make swishing and humming noises, and their lasers making zapping noises as they fire. All despite the fact that it's been scientifically proven there's absolutely no sounds in space. That is um, We have not oh, changed at all. Oh, I fucking we love that. We have done That's awesome. nothing. That's awesome. I hope there's a shield bag too from Gong. And IG is dead, but... Yeah, don't buy into the, like, ugh. It just, it's so frustrating to me that people can't even be like, I just don't like this. You don't have to, like, get mad at people and harass them. If that's not your thing, that's okay. Like, like, I don't like Rise of Skywalker. I'm not gonna harass anyone about it. 
and I will fuck your day up if you come at me liking anything I don't like. <laughs> I love the uh, the Patriots. Doesn't everyone love the Patriots? Er no one's harassing you, Axion. You said someone should be fired. You're harassing that person. <laughs> I'm so behind on the book. Okay, there it is. I think we're all caught up on actual what should happen. Oh. L3 natties from LO rolling like a champ. L3 takes Two one. Damage into L3. This game has not progressed the way I expected it to go. A little back and forthy. Yeah, it's pretty good. That's a pretty good game. Nine. Range two, two on two. Really needs it. Hey, hey, that's good. <laughs> His closed mindedness. Natties! His closed mindness prevents him from seeing the fact Santa goes to live in Finland. But Santa does not live in Finland. He has never lived in Finland. He will never live in Finland. Do not besmirch his name. Axion, you said she should go somewhere like the mailing department. So she should not be in her current job. She should lose her job. It's the same thing, man. Eight out of eight natties on Indo's side. Yeah, Colfax is getting steamed, as I imagine. Well, Colfax probably doesn't care, but Clofax. Oof. True. Yeah, that's the thing, Jordan. I agree with you, too. Like, if Axion has hated everything from the Disney era of Star Wars, then yeah, okay. I am comfortable with him saying that Kathleen Kennedy should go. If he has liked anything from the current era of Star Wars, it's a little more nuanced than that. And that's the moral of the story. And truthfully, this respect for Rogue One. Agreed. Rogue One is definitely a top three Star Wars movie for me. I think. The first, it's so. I have this theory about Rogue One, where like the first third is kind of all over the place. The middle act is okay, and the last act is really good, which is like the critical portion of the movie you want really good. So, like, I think just because like it, it has such a great ending, it makes people like it a lot more than I think that. Yeah, be honest, is. can we agree that the Gendi Tarkovsky Clone Wars was superior? Get the fuck out of here. Get the <laughs> fuck out of here. <laughs> I see that a lot. I see that opinion a lot, and I, I no! don't think I agree with that. I don't no! think I agree with that. <laughs> Please. Mace riding a fucking vulture like a surfboard. Yeah. Ugh. See, Twitchy, I disagree with that too. Not tying one director with three property, properly linked scripts of the franchise before filming. You don't need that to make it work. Because no, the I, OT I didn't know. do that. I 100% agree with that. Twitchy. 100%. And the, the prequel trilogy did that, though, and was kind of a failure. No. Uh, first of all, the all three of those prequels are in like the top 20 grossing movies of all time. But Sure, but so are the, so are the Disney movies. Like, they gross more, is my point. Like We can't go off of money-wise. Okay. They were you, critically. When you there was such a failure that th there was such a failure that George Lucas gave up and quit Star Wars. I mean, if he had done that like two years after, sure. 12, 12 to fifteen years after, I don't think that's a fair assessment of what happened. Yeah, you can make a co you can make a cohesive story without writing it ahead of time. You just need to like not do whatever they did and. Uh, Jar Jar is the best character in Star Wars. I think we all agree with that. George Lucas got fucking old, and he was like, I have more money than I know what to do with. I'm going to just piss off rich people in my area, even though I am a rich person in my area. His floors are open. He can't barrel roll. Yeah, that's right, Ando. Yeah, floors Don't are open. Can't barrel roll. 4v1. <laughs> Apparently George Lucas just makes weird like experimental films right now and I'm, I'm like Jamming Bean. Why jam are you jamming bean? Why is he using jamming bean right now, Greg? What the hell is happening? Alright, well he lost a lot. Great. Congrats. Oh he didn't use it, thank god. Oh my god, I would be mad. Yeah, I can tell you right now, Axion, Kathleen Kennedy doesn't do what you think she does. Um, if you think she's the reason to blame for the movies, but not the TV shows. I, I do not understand how you can blame Kathleen Kennedy for the movies yeah, if, and then if not she give her credit blame, for the shows. If she deserves blame for the movies, she deserves credit for the shows and for Rogue One. But if she d doesn't deserve credit, she doesn't deserve blame. It's such like an easy... 
Ugh, you just can't have your cake and eat it too. Crit, it, crit, direct hit, game direct. over. The droids win! Circle nice. our argument! Anyways, George Lucas apparently makes like really weird indie creator films at home, and I really like he You're just right never he shows them to his friends and that's it. And I honestly want to retire like that. Oh yeah, I mean he sold Star Wars for 4.6 billion dollars. Oh my god. 